Hi Jay Peeps and welcome back to the T-Rex Paddock for another Let's Play. Please like, comment, and subscribe. It helps get our videos out to other dinosaur and paleo enthusiasts like you. As always, we would like to thank each of our subscribers and viewers. Our love of dinosaurs, gaming, and you guys are why we do this. So a Jurassic thank you to all. Alright guys, I think we're going to settle on this Rex here. Alright, let's get going. Hold on to your butts. We're starting out with a fresh new new Rex here on the server. go we are starting at 40 percent growth so we are a wee one guys let's see if we can make it to adulthood with this little juvenile rex And it's spin. My points to get started here. I saw some gore smell over there, but I'm not going to go after that right now. Really small and hesitant to run into anything bigger than me. I think the server has a rule against killing fresh spawns, but I've been killed immediately several times. And I'm not going to go to the links of reporting it and turning in a video and all this stuff to accuse someone. Not not right now anyway. I have yet to get that angry. A lot of this is trial and error and I kind of understand when a larger dinosaur eats a I guess for them a perceived hatchling. It's an easy quick meal. Guys, and if you haven't yet, strike that like button. It really helps us get our videos out to other dinosaur gaming enthusiasts like you. This helps push the video with the algorithm, and it really, really helps us out. Gets the channel out to more people. Gets suggested more by the algorithm. So, really appreciate it if you can... Strike the like. We're really grateful for all of our viewers and our subscribers. We have surpassed 8,100, and that's a big deal for us guys. Like, it just continues to grow, and we're really grateful to all of our subscribers. If you are a viewer and you've yet to subscribe, We'd really appreciate it if you strike that red subscribe button and join us here on the T-Rex Paddock and become a part of our community so you can get notified about future videos and other content. All right, let's get into it. There's quite a few people on the server, I believe. So 
we're just going to be really cautious right now. If we become someone's lunch, we'll start again, guys. Recent remodeling of the T Rex in the game. I really like the new accurate Rex model that they've implemented. It took a little bit for me to warm up to it, but I've decided I really like it. I like the other one that they had previously, it was pretty neat. A lot of people around the United States this week and around this time of year at spring break so if you're on spring break that's awesome i hope you're enjoying it Many dinosaurs are peaceful at the watering hole, but I have been eaten at the watering hole, so I don't just rush in. I tend to be peaceful at the watering hole and not bother other dinosaurs no matter what kind they are. Yeah. 
I'm being really cautious through this area, you guys, because when I play Megalosaurus, I kind of lurk around the rocky areas, waiting for a passerby. The water is rising. Oh boy. Leave me alone, Trump. I thought he was going to attack me, but the bird left. It's a pteranodon. Sometimes they can be pesky. The rising water levels make it making the threat of aquatic reptile encroachment very real. I don't want to be eaten by a mosasaur. Now that nap time is over, guys, we're moving on. We're going to try to find something alive or a carcass to eat. It doesn't matter. We're just hungry. All, always staying ever aware of our surroundings. Other carnivores are always a lurking threat.
make our way through this cacti. Before the halfway mark, we're going to go ahead and migrate. I just don't see this place be being a, a good place for our Tyrannosaur. Oh boy. We're in trouble. Please don't kill me. Maybe they're gonna let us live. Had they wanted to eat us, there was no escape from that situation. Well, hopefully they don't realize how scarce food is over here and come back to eat me. They may be regretting letting me go in a few minutes. Hopefully we are far enough away that they can't follow me. I'm not quite sure how long the Centrale lasts. What are you? It's a Pachycephalosaurus. Hmm. Hello, Friar Tuck. Good luck with those big tyrannosaurs. So far we've been pretty lucky, those two, those two large tyrannosaurs, they could have just had a snack. I'm like, please adopt me, you guys. Uh... Earlier today, I wasn't recording, but I was hunted down by Acro... Uh, it was a pack of three Acrocanthosauruses. They just ripped me apart. I had no chance. I was by myself. No squad to back me up. I died alone. But I injured one of them pretty badly. I mauled him before I died. Had I been bigger, I might have one shot at him and killed him. Okay. Next thing we're leveling up to the third possible skill point is sneaky, because we've got to get these footsteps more quiet. We want to survive as a small tyrannosaur. We're going to need quiet. Oh. I can't 
can't tell what's there. There's a a scent signature. I can't tell if he flew off with the entire thing. We need to eat though. We got 34% food left. Yeah, that shrub, he flew off with that. No, he didn't. Maybe he flew off with some of it. Lucky we found some water. You can hear that shrub scurrying around. Look at him. Hello. What's up, little guy? Megalosaurus is you guys, we gotta get out of here. They will eat us. It may be too late. It's an entire herd. Oh wow, look at all the paras.
I know those two megalosauruses, they can't be too far behind, but hopefully the herd distracts them. We need to get out of this area. Careful, girl. You don't want to fall. Can't afford to be injured. A moment of weakness and we die. We may die even if we don't have a moment of weakness. It's a hard knocks life being a solitary rex. Finally got hydrated. All the Parasaurolophus, they made me realize how small in comparison to the adult animals we still are as this juvenile Rex. Had I fancied a fight with them, that entire group, they would have torn me limb from limb. I wouldn't have survived that. So we made sure they knew we cowered. I know we're the Tyrant Lizard King, but you gotta know when to pick your fights. Sounds like the weather is changing on us. There are tornadoes in this game from time to time. So we need to be cautious of the weather. Oh no. Well, this may be us in trouble. Hello. I think he's going to try to attack us, but I'm not sure. Oh, there were two. We're in trouble. We're done for.
So we respawned back on the island, you guys. I'm not too enthusiastic that we've been put back on the same island as the two Megalosauruses that killed us just a few minutes ago. So I think we may find a way off of this island. There is no water there. It is completely dry. It's pretty cool. I like this game. The water sources can be depleted if used too much. Scarcity of resources. And apparently, scarcity of food today. I was looking for stuff. I'm sure those two Megalosauruses had looked for gore already. <laughs> I had seen them earlier. Somehow we just ran into... Ran, they, they got lucky and ran into me as a meal. <laughs> I wanted to be really angry, but I mean, hate the game and not the player, right? That's what it is, survival. They were working in pairs, they were both quite a bit larger than me. There was no getting away from me. I thought I heard something flapping overhead. I may have, and he might have just been really fast.
so we may go back to the desert island. That tends to be the that's like the starter island for me. That's where I usually like to grow and then branch out once I get a bit bigger. Returning to this island, my mind, my mind starts to think about the two tyrannosaurs from earlier. Boy, oh boy! I hope we don't run into those two. They won't have the same pity on me as an Acrocanthosaurus as they, as they did on me when I was a tyrannosaur. We definitely want our Acrocanthosaurus to be geared towards combat, but we also want it able to sneak and be survival, survival oriented. Found more gore, I believe. I'm not picking up the scents of any other carnivores nearby either. Nor any other dinosaur for that matter. Hopefully most everybody is on the larger islands. Or they seem to be more for later progression. That was really nice of him. I didn't expect that. I really expected him to take everything. Thank you, nice little trip.
bad luck with the Megalosaurus today. Hopefully he doesn't come after me. Looks like they have gore. My favorite. I get why people pick that animal class. It's a fast dinosaur. I'll be really glad when they add the Utah Raptor. I hope that is soon. You hear me, developers? Alrighty, J-Peeps, it's certainly been an adventure today. As I bring the video to a close, I would like to say thank you again for watching. Join us on social media, especially our Discord. Links are in the description below. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't. Over the past couple of months, with a large influx of viewers, around 95% of our audience has yet to subscribe. It would be really swell if you joined the T-Rex Paddock in working towards our next goal of reaching 10,000 subscribers. We really have fun doing these for you guys, and we'll be back soon with the next one. And stay tuned for other T-Rex Paddock projects. Our ever-expanding offerings include Paleo and Jurassic Franchise News, Dinosaur Gaming, and more. As always, JPs, remember, if something chases you, run.